What's up ghouls? It's Blaze and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming for you another Spooky Box Club unboxing and I'm so excited about this. It is the Mystic, as you can hopefully see there on the sticker. Um, I haven't got themed hair and makeup for this box because I didn't really know how to do the Mystic. Um, obviously the post you see on Instagram is literally just a sticker so I knew it was black and white and that's it. I guess my top is coordinating. I guess that counts as a half assed attempt. But yeah, so I'm so excited to get into this. I've no idea what is going to be in there. Um, the box only came today so I haven't seen anyone else's videos about this so that's my favourite is when I don't know what's in there and it hasn't been like spoiled by other people. Not that it's spoiled but you know what I mean. So we have the confetti that I can see straight away is teeny tiny moons, so cute. Um, so there's the card that says what's in there, so I'm not going to read that. There's all the doodads that pumpkin likes to attack. <laughs> not put those on the floor this time. Okay. Ooh, this looks interesting. So there's a bag and it's got like wood circles or something in it. Let's see what this is. One bag we've got a silver chain. And this bag says DIY moon face garland ready to paint, stain, and customize. <gasps> that is so adorable. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight circles, and they have different phases of the moon on. Oh my god, it smells like at school with like a laser cutter. Um, so they're not like obviously attached, that you have to attach those yourself onto the chain. And you can see here the different phases of the moon etched on so you would be able to paint them and decorate them in any way that you want um, so I might film myself doing that um, at a later date when I do that and I will also film the jewellery holder or necklace holder whatever it's called that came in one of the previous boxes I can do a little spooky box club DIY day so that will be fun that is that Next, oh my god, that's so cool. <gasps> this is so exciting. Oh my god, is it a key ring? <gasps> yes, this is going straight on my key right now. This is amazing. So it's a huge key ring and it's got two skeleton hands around a crystal ball with some purpley smoke and stuff. And it almost matches my first tattoo that I got of the two hands holding a crystal ball. How cute. Oh my god, love it. I love big chunky key rings and I love the colours on that. It's just so cool. Love it. That might be my favourite thing of the box. And it's only the second thing I've opened. Okay, next up we have a pin. It's the Psychic pin. So it's a crescent moon with Psychic written on it. I don't know how well you'll be able to see it because it's very glittery. That's so super cute. I love that. Oh, it's so pretty. I love this colour scheme of like the purple, the black and the white so adorable love it okay we've got some kind of crystal ball in this bag and it's bubble wrapped so it's nice and protected which i love i'd be so sad if something arrived broken like i'd probably cry i'm not gonna lie oh this looks like it could be a pendulum maybe it's quite big for a pendulum oh i think it might be got a big old chunky crystal ball on the bottom and it's just on chain hasn't got anything to like attach it it's like a key ring or a necklace or anything so I think I think it may be a pendulum if so guys you're huge my pendulum's like this big so a pendulum is used as a divination tool um so that's pretty cool I love this box this is like rivaling the fortune teller box this is a and what was the other one I had that I loved was it sweet nightmares I can't remember which one the other one was I loved but I'm loving this. So we have a white and purple lollipop, which is so cute. The colours are cute. In this bag, oh my god, this is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Okay, so it's a tiny little charm for the bracelet, and it's a tiny planchette that says Ouija on it. Oh my god, I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. This is so cute. Oh my god, I'm in love with that. Oh, okay. So the next thing looks like another pendulum. Um, I, oh, this is a necklace. Okay, so this necklace here, it's not on the chain for some reason. Let me just pop it on the chain. Okay, that's 
took longer than I thought. <laughs> okay, so it's on a long silver chain and then it's got a black crystal at the end. It looks like, like onyx or maybe a heme type, I don't know. But it's very cute. And this is like the size of the pendulum that I have, so um, I guess it's just like a pendulum style necklace. Maybe you could use it on the go. If you suddenly needed to contact the spirits, then you are well prepared. <laughs> Um, so that's the little baggy things. Um, here we have a really cute iron-on patch that um, is like a what's that even called? Like a label style thing that says mm, mystical. That's so adorable. Oh my god, this is like this is my favorite box. This is 100% my favorite box. This is so cute. So here we have um, DIY witchcrafting, and this is how to make the garland. Um, it's got instructions and like what bits to paint and stuff in case you weren't sure. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, I love it. Oh, oh it says share your creations with us at Spooky Box Club for a chance to be featured on our Instagram. Do you know what? Maybe I will. That is just so cute. I'm so excited to read this. And I'm in the mood for DIYing at the moment. I went out today and bought so much DIY stuff for my Halloween videos. Oh, I thought there was one print at the bottom, but there's two. Oh my god, okay, this is so pretty. Okay, I'm going to take these out of the plastic so you can properly see them without the reflective glare from the ring light. So the first is, um, what's it called? Palmistry? Is that what you call it? Palm reading. Um, so it's got like zodiac signs on there, different planet signs, and the lines and stuff. Oh my god, it's so pretty. That's definitely going to be framed and on my wall. That is so gorgeous. I love the colours of that. Oh, so gorgeous. Okay, and then the next one is the Lunar Calendar for 2018, which if you're a witch, you will understand that the Lunar Calendar is very important. So now, again, I'm so sorry about the noise. Pumpkin is going crazy on that computer. Pumpkin, calm. Um, yeah, the lunar calendar is very important and now you won't ever have to, there's like an app I have of the moon phases but now I don't need it because I can just see it right here. So cute. So yeah, that is everything in the box. I'm going to read the card to check we got everything. So custom made DIY moon phase garland, we've got that. Custom made psychic glitter moon pin, custom made planchette bracelet charm, custom made crystal ball bag charm, crystal ball bag. Oh, that's a bag charm. That's huge. That is a bag charm. Holy shit. That's going to knock a child out if that hits them in the head. Oh my god. Hmm. I don't, I don't think I'm going to put that on a bag. I'm a bit scared to put that on a bag. Maybe hang it on the wall or something. I don't know. I'll definitely find a use for it. Mystical patch. Um, crystal sun catcher. Oh, unless that's the sun catcher. Yeah, okay, I'm with you. So that is the bag charm, and that is the sun catcher. That makes sense. Okay, I'm with it. Onyx pendulum necklace, moved onyx, lunar calendar 2018, mystical palmistry art print, and a handcrafted gourmet lollipop. Okay, I'm glad the confusion of the bag charm is solved. Um, yeah, this has been such a gorgeous box. If there is any box that is going to convince you to subscribe to Spooky Box Club, this is the fucking box. This is so gorgeous. I'm just so happy with everything. There's not one thing that I look at and I'm like, eh, bit shit. Like, I love everything. So, I hope you have enjoyed watching this unboxing. Um, I do one of these every month, give or take a week or so depending on when they arrive because it is a small company and everything's handcrafted things can take longer to be made and stuff so it doesn't always come exactly on a certain day um but it's definitely worth the wait so yeah i hope you have enjoyed watching i hope pumpkin's noises haven't bothered you too much you're so naughty <laughs> So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed watching, let me know down below what you thought of this box, and yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!